Christ Wood here, September 8th, 2021, 2.09 p.m. Ever since I got up this morning, I've been having what feels like air blowing into my head, into the spot next to the cut or whatever it is on the back of my head. Going in here. I'm being choked up. It feels like I'm having something sprayed into me. I'm losing my memories. I'm losing feeling in my body. I'm losing feeling in my head, which I've had. I'm obviously going through skull deforming. Brain injuring body. <coughs> I'm having my brain burned out of my head through tech, through implants in me. From William Billy Woldridge of 149 Center Street. He is the boss to OPP. He is the boss to Spencer Mills and boyfriend. He is the boss to Staff Sergeant, lover, and sex assaulter. He is the boss, co offender, stalker of children with the chief. He is the boss of Shannon Cork, laugher in, his, a laugher in people's face over his arrest. His foot soldier. He is boss to Robert Lucas. He is boss to Robert Kane. He is boss to Stacy, a mental health worker. He is boss to Shelly Huffington, he is boss to Dr. Tatiana V. <sighs> if anything happens to me, this has been two plus years because of me speaking of police crimes. I'm going through identity theft. My brain is being fucked up. And this is how OPP, the ones named, and William Aldridge of 149 Center Street, North Napanee, is getting away with the crimes on me. They put, they put his prisoner tracking into me for stalking, for framing, arrest refusals, lies, time buying, cover-ups. Two plus years of this illegal surveillance through remote narrow monitoring. That's how I am reading as him as well. This is how he is getting his identity theft and this is how I am getting my brain fried out of my head. This and MK Ultra. The whole where I've been brain split and it can be proven I have no feeling at all only that spot on the back of my head back of my head's pretty much gone completely flat. Thank you very much, you fucking terrorists. I cannot go to a hospital. I cannot get help. Anything happens to me, they must be charged for homicide. And they're also guilty of stalking my mother. They are also guilty of causing her death as well. I spoke of police crimes. I've been injured, tortured, brain damaged, skull deformed sex assaulted, testicle tortures the blood, brain fucked, body tortured, the whole right side of my body is pretty much fucking gone. I'm, I don't even feel like I'm breathing, it only feels like I have one lung now. This is not illness, this is not mental illness, this is not drugs. This is from Tech in me. This is from William Aldridge in me. This is about frying my fucking brain. This is about turning me into a vegetable. 
so the ones responsible can get away with it. My identity theft and my mother's homicide, my attempted homicide, William Waldridge is an alleged Hells Angels leader of Ontario. He's an inmate escapee, he's boss, lover, and co-offender with the ones named. Highly protected. Lives at 149 Center Street North, Napanee. He is a child stalker, pedophile, human sex trait, slavery. I haven't been able to get any medical help, any legal help. Anything happens to me, the ones named are responsible and they must face homicide. Anyone comes against me from orders on them, you are guilty of aiding them, aiding and abetting them in this with the boss, Waldridge, in this identity theft brain fuck. And it can be proven. No neurological problems, no psychological problems, no institutions, no hospitals, no doctors. I had no reason to. If I would have had to have needed to, I would have seek the help that I haven't had to. It has nothing to do with mental illness. It has nothing to do with drugs. No criminal record or history. But yet, yeah, I have William Wilder's prisoner tracking put onto me for this agenda revenge crime and the agenda is his identity theft in my death and the revenge is in my death from the OPP and from Wildridge, through Wildridge, including my mother's. How it's being done through tech. This is how people disappear. This is how people are being um, murdered, human trafficked right here in Lennox and Addington under unsuspecting eyes and noses because it's being done by the police and others. William Waldridge's brother, Blair, is also involved in this. He is a meth dealer here in Napanee. This is pretty much done, congratulations. I'm not gonna see fucking another year because I'm gonna be dead and gone. And this better be taken serious. Christ would love all. Hate none.